question. What is the mission? Does anybody know? Anybody? What is it? What is it? Get money. Wait, hang on, that's that's gonna be demonetized, won't it? Oh. How do we go about accomplishing said mission? Mm. They say Rome wasn't built in a day, but bit by bit, piece by piece, it was put together. So today, we shall be adding another one of those pieces in the form of integrated contributions. Now, what is that? What is that? Good question. Over here at twitch.tv forward slash Randy, you can scroll down, hit the support button, and that leads you to Randy's fund. Hmm, classic. Now this right here, Disruptus contributed one Canadian dollar three hours ago, like a champion. Some of you boys who have already contributed may be wondering, this contribution note down here, where is it going? What's its purpose? Can Randy see my contribution message? Um, no. No, I can't. It's, uh, I have no way of seeing it at the moment. But that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be building out a dashboard for all the recent contributions, as well as creating an OBS media source for them. So they can show up on stream. Maybe we'll have it, like, tucked away in, like, a little corner or something. Who knows? Who knows? So, boys, this is our first step is going to be setting up an OBS browser source. Um, I have no idea how to do that. Browser source is one of the most versatile sources available in OBS. It is quite literally a web browser that you can add directly to OBS. This allows you to perform all sorts of custom layout. Yep, blah, blah, blah. So, I'm thinking all I've literally got to do, right, is make a web page with like a list of um, things, right? And we can just slap that on OBS directly and it should just work, you know? So, let's just go ahead and try it out. Let's do it. To start off with, let's just try adding a browser source um, just directly from the web page. Just add the home, the home web page. It's not gonna be that easy. Oh wait, hang on. I just, there's two HTTPS is there. My bad. Whoopsies. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Does it animate as well? Oh, it animates. It's literally just the website. So much raw power. This is gonna be easy as hell. Hot damn. Okay, Nick. So the first thing that we're gonna wanna do is go ahead and create a new page. I'm gonna create the dashboard first, I reckon. So dashboard.tsx. So reading.dd forward slash dashboard. Um, I don't wanna show the, I don't want Google to crawl this. So we won't include any um, SEO stuff. We'll have to make a robots.txt to tell Google not to crawl it. All right, so import React element, lovely. And that should give us, we call this dashboard. If we go to localhost forward slash dashboard, it exists, it's a page, it works, awesome. So we can go ahead and put whatever the hell I want in here. It's just a blank page at the moment. Um, What am I gonna wanna do? How can I make it transparent? Is that even a thing? I don't think it is. Uh, BG white. Okay, doesn't like that. And we are going to add this as a source. So let's just put something in here. So like a, uh, a H1. Frick bitches. Ooh, okay, okay. That works. We've got it up. We've got it up here. Look at that. Seamless. All right, so if we don't make the background white, then it should be, yeah. Oh, awesome. This is easy as hell. Oh my God. I had no idea it would be this easy. <laughs> Do donations on website appear on stream? No, that's what we're doing literally right this very second. We're getting them to appear on screen. So you see this frick bitches right here? That's going to be your donation in a bit. The next question that we want to answer, question time. How do we want to go about getting the donations to display? Should they be in a list? Should they just be one by one? Like, like, like the latest one scrolling down here sideways or something? Nice and simple. Or there should be like a list of the latest five. Maybe each sort of fading in opacity. Like a block. How do we want to do it? I think I have the answer. We will go ahead. Like everything in life, if you don't know how to do it, you steal other people's designs. Hey, he's just got a thing up in the top. Nick Merckx. What has he got? He's got a little scrolling thing. Minimal. I like it. Scroll center little jittery. JS, nah, it would. I would apply the scroller in post. We can just keep it simple for now, just just as long as it's working, right? That's all that really matters at the end of the day. Okie dokie. First things first. Um, uh, yeet. Beauty. Tell you what, we can just enable this on the screen here. So to make it functional, I'm literally just going to. We're just gonna collapse it into one. We're not even gonna bother listing all five. We're just gonna put them all in one. And so we're just gonna be a scrolling text. Um, so we'll put this as a to-do later on. We'll just eat it for the time being though. And I'm literally just going to data dot donations at the first index is recurring. All right, so let's adjust this, uh, this browser source. Make the height 100. I really need to just come up with a good overlay. <laughs> the time being, I'm literally just gonna do that. And we're not gonna have a background and it's gonna be scrolling text. 
Five dollars. So if we go ahead and we're gonna become a new member, we make this uh, ten. Uh, we'll go. Actually, I don't have any of the test amounts to that. So we'll go euro. Ba 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 ba. Yetus Maximus, have my money. Contribute. It just updated like that. Look at that. SWR baby. Look at that. Sexy. Ah damn. All right. So let's chuck a text gradient on this bad boy. Awesome. And chuck a text gradient on the mount. All right, that looks fucking sexy. Holy shit. Right here, boys. Look at that. Contributed to the fund. And then if we make a recurring, actually, we can just test the last one. Back to one. That one should be recurring. Yeah. Became a member. Contributed. Yeah, done it. There is now a distinction between recurring and not recurring. Awesome. So I think that's done, honestly. I see things that I want to do before the end of the day. Um, and that is, open up the trailer. Recent contributions as an OBS source is Donsky. Beautiful. Next up, I want to build up a dashboard for viewing all recents as well as the contribution message. So my own personal thing that I can just have up on screen uh, so that way I can see your guys' uh, contribution messages and stuff right now all it is is this little uh thing up here and it doesn't show the message it's just a nice little snippet of uh of the donor so that's all gonna sort out next as well i do want to get this up on the live today um so i'm gonna have to go through and touch up all the uh all the <laughs> all the things that are wrong with the build at the moment like there not being a menu bar here and all that good stuff so that's all we're gonna sort out um what i also need to do for the menu bar is right now on mobile it doesn't actually have a home button uh, so i should probably do something with that Okay, that really just doesn't work on mobile. <laughs> I should really update this. I can't be arsed getting into the CSS for it though. Sorted. That's all the data there. We can successfully yeet all of this. Oh, oh, that's amazing. That feels so good. That's better than sex. Yep, I'm gonna go in here and I'm going to delete the globals. Because that is just poor form. Honestly, poor form. Randy GG font mission. That right, was a mission down here. Down here. All right. Text to Excel. All right. So what's this text? Is this still for Excel? For Excel, and then SM is going to be text dash six Excel. Boysies, we are pushing to master. We've successfully merged the schema branch and it is going up to the live production site. The CSS Tailwind rework as well as this little thing over here. Let us await the build and finally switch this bad boy over to the live. Wait for that little little orange circle to go green and switch over to production. Should happen any second now. Come on, give it to me, baby. Give it to me. Oh, there it is. And with that, ladies and gents, is the merge. We have successfully completed the Tailwind CSS rework. And with that, what we can now do is go to rainy.gg forward slash dashboard dash OBS. It's there. It's there. It's there. Boys, ready? Ready, ready, ready? Are you ready for this? Boom. Sammy boy. Thank you very much for the 10 smackaroonies, baby. Welcome to the club. Welcome to the member club. Ah, damn, we done, boys. Is it finally time to work on the game again? Who knows? Who knows? I guess, uh, I guess we'll find out on Tuesday. Adios, boys. Take care. Sleep tight. See you in a bitty.